uh, find two positive numbers a and b that minimizes the sum of twice a and b so let's think about this the sum of twice a and b so twice a or in other words 2a plus b this is the thing that i want to minimize and the other thing i know is the product of the two numbers product is times is 288 so a times b is 288. so if i take the derivative of this that's going to help me find the max min that's how i find extremes but it's in terms of two variables so I'm going to get it in terms of one variable. So I think that what I'll do is I'll just uh, divide both sides by B here. So I've got uh, A equals 288 over B. I could have divided both sides by A. That would be fine as well. And I'm going to take this and plug it into that other equation. So 2 times A, which is 288 over B, uh, plus B. That's This is the thing that I want to minimize. And let's see, 288 times 2, what's that, 5... 76 I think so this is the sum of 2a and b where a is equal to 288 divided by b so I want to minimize this thing so I'm going to take its derivative relative to b and then I will um, set that equal to zero to find, a, to find an extreme so over b this is the same as 576 times b to the negative 1 plus b Still taking the derivative of that. You can power rule this, negative 576 times b to the negative 2 plus derivative of b relative to b is 1. And that's that derivative. I'll set it equal to 0. All right. How about I add this to both sides? Get 1 equals uh, 5766 b to the negative 2. And then this whole uh, b to the negative 2 thing, Boy, my sixes look like Bs. Sorry about that. Um, this B to the negative 2, that's like 1 over B squared, right? That's the same as, as this. And so to solve this, I can multiply both sides by B squared to get it out of this denominator. So B squared is 5766. I square root that. B would be plus or minus 24, but they were positive numbers. Yep. So that means B must be 24. And if B is 24, I can plug it back into here. Um, A times B is a 288, and that would be a 12. So there's my two numbers.